Good morning, cultists. Welcome back to another Unbalanced Breakfast with Kuta Loops. In our last episode, we ended things off after having cleared out the Amphiclea military camp of uh, Spartan soldiers, as well as a lion and a panther? Or, no, it wasn't a jaguar, it was a panther. Yes. Alright, um, and we're gonna go clear out more of the Grand Mount Parnassos. The reason why I'm enunciating that is because every time I try to read that, I say ground mount. Which frightens Rodney, because he's a mount, and he of course does not want to turn into uh, ground meat. Unless, unless Rodney, that's actually your fetish. But, I don't know if I'm comfortable with that fetish, Rodney. I'm just saying. I am, however, comfortable with the fetish of collecting olive wood. But now that I'm level 20, I should not take any damage from falling. So, Rodney, we're going to exploit this to the max and do some heavy, heavy exploring. Um, of course, that doesn't mean that Rodney can just climb anything. All right, Rodney, here we are at this place. And... Um... Rodney? Rodney? Hey, buddy. He's just taking a nap. He'll be fine. What is this again? Cave of Kratos. All right. Well, how appropriate for Rodney to um to uh, die <laughs> in front of the cave of Kratos. Let's face it. Rodney's dead. He's not getting back up from that. <laughs> well, I mean, at least I didn't take any damage. Ah, uh, wow. But that is pretty hilarious that he died right in front of the uh, Cave of Kratos. Um, now wait, is this the Cave of Kratos because this is where Kratos came to die after his adventures in Scandinavia? Or is this where the Greeks thought Kratos' remains are laid to rest after they thought he died in Greece? Hmm. Because as far as the uh, Grecians are, or the Greeks are concerned, Kratos died after he, um, you know, beat the ever-loving shit out of Zeus, right? Maybe. Whoa! Cassandra, holy shit, that was dangerous. Whoa! Nice find, Cassandra. Nice find. Thank you. And anything else down here? Yes, there is. We'll collect that as well. Perfect. So, location objectives, kill the clan chief and loot the treasure. What the hell? And... That's another dead horse. Well, I feel... I certainly feel less bad about having, uh... You know, Rodney fall to his death. Because it seemed like someone else had the same idea as I did. <laughs> loot that, Cassandra. Loot it, and loot it good. Okay. Uh, what are we looking at? Oh, is this a cave of uh, the Cult of Cosmos? Hmm. Kind of wish I had Icarus do a little bit of a preliminary scouting before I got in here now. Alright. So there's a dude over there. Great. And I saw... Oh, there's a dude over there behind the bushes. Another dude back there. Um... I don't think it's going to be too difficult. But we should still be a little cautious, just in case. Now, what level are these guys? Level 19. And I'm level 20, so maybe I should be okay. Oh, is this guy coming this way? Hey, buddy. Yo. Check it out. Get over here. Get over here, boy. Do it. No, you know what you know you want to. Fantastic. Into the bushes. Great. What about this guy? I saw someone go in that direction. I kind of get the feeling if I jump him now, um, his buddy behind there will probably notice. Oh shit, there's another guy. I wonder if he'll come the same way. No, he's not coming this way. And there's a big boy. Shit. Tisandros? Hmm. 
I wonder if I can kill him in one fell swoop. He doesn't seem like the type that would die in one fell swoop. Don't get too close to Sandros. Don't get too close. Yeah, no, that's definitely not a uh, one-hit kill. Alright, well, that concerns me. I wonder if perhaps... Shit, maybe I should have waited until night. Alright, well, there's relatively few people- Oh shit, I gotta go now! Shit. To Sandros, come this way so that we don't alert your fellow clan members. Now, when you say clan, do you mean like a familial clan or... Do you mean like a clan that, I don't know, um, goes around wearing ghost costumes outside of Halloween? What kind of clan are we talking about here, Tissandros? Doesn't matter, I guess, because he's dead. Alright, so there's one dude over there, two dudes over that side. I don't think I can do a rush assassination on him yet. Hmm. I wonder, though. He thought he saw something. He thought he saw a putty tat. I'll show you a putty tat. Oh, what the hell? Really? Shit. Alright, fine. Mm, then I'll do it this way! Bitch! What about your buddy back there? He wants some this? No, he don't want some this. Alright, let's see if we can get the jump on him from up high. Ignore the, uh... The fuck? <laughs> Alright, well, I guess that worked. Sure. Uh, I'm not gonna complain about that. So, are we good here? From my initial scans, it seems like we're... Here by ourselves now. Though, there might be more dudes in that section of the cave. So, let's not be too hasty. Alright, I'll get this. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. What the fuck? What the fuck? I apparently can't get this. Thank you very much. What the fuck? What the hell? Why couldn't I get that? Oh, I get it. It was the final trial of Kratos. The one that he could never pass because he was too, too angry and too impatient, even after his journeys in Scandinavia, which definitely matured, uh, matured him as a person, um, and as a father, but, uh, you know, still, it was a little too much for him. Anything in the pit of dead people? Yes, the final treasure chest? Yeah, nice. And some more stuff this way. Alright, we have completed the cave of Kratos. Still no indication as to whether it's... Hey buddy. How, uh... How you doing? Doing alright? For Zeus, you say? Well, for Zeus it is, my friend. For Zeus it is. <laughs> oh my god. I can't tell if he's that's his battle cry or maybe that's just him screaming because he's on fire. Oh, well, he's dead, so... Hey, 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 we leveled up from that! <laughs> Extra experience points for torturing a person. <laughs> wow. Incredible. Best game ever. Holy shit. But as I was saying before I was so rudely interrupted by uh, Burn Victim McGee over there, um... Still no indication as to whether this is uh, Kratos' final resting place, or whether the Greeks think that this is Kratos' final resting place, or maybe this is where Kratos come, came to retire to start his own family. Maybe that's what they call the uh, clan of Kratos. 
You never know. He might have gotten remarried after, um, you know, his wife in Scandinavia died. Right? It's possible. It's possible. People get remarried a few times sometimes. Yeah. Alright, anything else? Over this way? Yeah. Nice. And, uh, we good now? Okay, there's... I missed something. I'm sorry, guys. I have to get it. What is it? What did I miss? Better be something good. Better be something good. Four iron metal. Alright, well, I'll classify that as good. Oh. Okay, I heard something over here. And I see something over there. Thank you, Sandra. It's a very extensive cave network, isn't it? Holy crap. And uh, anything else? Nope, not this way. Don't worry about falling down, uh, Cassandra. You're immune to a fall damage now. Which is pretty marvelous. Conquest battle available. Malis, the wild lands of the north? What the fuck? Where am I? All my life I've heard stories of Leonidas. I can't believe I'm finally seeing where history was made. Wait, why is this place significant? Is this isn't Sparta? Oh, that place looks vaguely familiar. Hmm. I wonder if that's where the Battle of 300 took place. That could be it actually. So where the hell am I? What the f fuck? I'm here now. What the hell? Oh my god. <laughs> okay then. Um I'm sorry. Focus is fortified again? Why? It was like completely depleted of Spartan forces before. Why is it suddenly fortified? Is it just because I left it? Oh man, what the hell? Do I have to redo all that stuff again? Shit. That might be the case. Maybe that's why this guy's still here. Ah, alright, well. Man, we actually traveled quite a distance. You know what, I don't really feel like doing any mountaineering. Let's just uh, fast travel over to the Temple of Apollo. And then head down to the um, other location. I think there's the Temple of... Pardonanipolipolipolipolipolipolipolipolipolipolipolipolipolipolipolipolipolipolipolipolipolipolipolipolipolipolipolipolipolipolipolipolipolipolipolipolipolipolipolipolipolipolipolipolipolipolipolip
We're done here. Maybe I can treat the priestess to some... Oh, 200 meters. Well, why couldn't she have just delivered it herself? What the fuck? She really had to go out of her way to hire a mercenary to do this job for her of just... I'm not a courier, damn it. But I guess I kind of am a courier. All right, fine. <sighs> I was kind of hoping I could um, make my way over to the temple of Athena Pronea. I said it right this time. Um, but no, looks like I'm being accosted by idiots who can't be bothered to uh, deliver messages by themselves. Whoa, jeez, Cassandra. I know you like getting uh, caught on fire, but come on now. It's a temple of Apollo. Share some respect. Maybe catch on fire in your own free time. Right, so... This is the politician? What's he gonna do? Hey, buddy. This is for you. Thanks. Here, for your efforts, mercenary. He straight up looked like a hobo. But I guess that is um, realistic, considering that a lot of politicians do, in fact, look like straight up hobos. Despite the fact that they make a lot of money doing God knows what. Oh, social commentary. Oh, snap. Anyways, now I believe I can finally make my way over to the temple of Athena. Athena's prolapsed anus. Um, and do my business there. It kind of looked like I had some stuff, people to kill and shit over there. But what would I need to kill in a temple? Was the temple being guarded? By Spartans? That seems a little odd. I guess we'll find out once we get there. Um, and you know what? Regardless of who or may, who or it may or may not be, we'll just kill them all. Sanctuary of Athena Pronea. Okay, is it like an actually guarded place? Let me take a look here. Let me get a look see. What do we got? All right. Oh. Oh, that mask. <gasps> They're cultists. It's the cult of Cosmos. I think, anyways. I could be wrong. Okay. Scion. That definitely sounds very cultish. Um, so we got a captain. We got a couple of guards. Okay, more than a couple of guards. We got an Enigma of Straka. We got some treasure. Um, what else we got? Any more cultist guards? Okay, there's one over there. And there is some treasure over that side, which is, I think, completely unrelated. A little uh, pond type situation with... Is that a carving? Or no, that's just wood. That's just dead tree. Got it. Is that it? Seems a little sparsely protected, I gotta say. Which is a little concerning, not gonna lie. Alright, that's fine. Aha, this guy's right here, so I wonder if perhaps I can get a, uh, an assassination on him immediately. Let's keep out of sight. Okay, well, I think he might actually be a little tougher than, I, uh, than I'd than i like. I might not be able to get a, uh, an assassination on him with one hit. So I think we should probably take out the little guys first, and then we'll deal with the uh, big one. And we'll start with this one. Oh, even the little ones. We have to, um... Fuck! I didn't see that there! Shit! Bushes. Okay. She is currently in a position where it would be easy for me to... ...assassinate her. But I need Cassandra to... Get up there, Cassandra! What are you doing, Cassie? Come on! Damn it, Cassie! I missed my opportunity, and she's not interested anymore. Shit, she solved the mystery of her dead compatriot. She's determined that he died from spontaneous face explosion. It runs in the family. It's a well-known, it's a well-documented condition. Shit. Damn it, Cassandra. We missed our golden opportunity now. Alright, so there's another asshole over there. Let's watch out for him, because she's definitely within uh, eye shot of him. Mm. 
Which means that it might be possible for me to take out... Wait, where'd the captain go? Oh, he's over there. Okay, good. Not good, but you know. Alright, so that's gonna be our next target as long as she moves her ass. Move it, lady! Ah, damn it. Maybe I should wait until night. You know what? Let me go meditate, and then come back when it's night time. And you know what? I'm just gonna meditate in these bushes. <laughs> nice. Look at that cloud. Hot damn. I don't think I look up into the sky often enough in this game. Alright. So hopefully that should improve our assassination strength. Now, with her. I think that's just enough damage. Nope, it is not just enough damage. Fuck. Okay, incoming Royal Rumble. That's not good. Shit. Ah, uh, fuck me. I thought for sure you would do enough damage to that uh, one person, but apparently it turns out it's not. Oh, those things count as big shields, eh? Interesting. Oh shit, he's doing some countering of his own. Alright, you're gonna make this sweet for me? That's very nice of you. Oh shit, the big boy's here. Alright, big boy. You'll get your chance. Just give me a sec. Nope, not today. Little shit. Whoa. Shitty counter, man. Shitty counter. Oh, crap. Ah, fuck. <laughs> ah, fuck. There we go. That shieldy McGee dead. And? Have I, though? I mean, it's certainly not good. But I wouldn't say it's the worst mistake of my life. I mean, I've made bigger mistakes. That's for sure. Oh, crap. Alright. Here we go. Fantastic. Kefios. Not today, Kefios. Oh, shit. Alright. Pretty small shield for a guy his size. Oh, well. That's fine. I guess it still counts as a big shield though, right? Get out of here, civilian! What the hell, man? Fucking, you see people swinging swords around wildly and you just stand there to watch? Actually, that's pretty realistic. I think a lot of people in uh, modern times would do that. In fact, they'd have their uh, cell phones out and their recording shit and whatnot, right? Oh, crap! I just walked right into that one. Alright, you son of a bitch. That's right, you punk ass. Nope, not today. Not fucking today. Ho oh, ho! Two dodges for the price of one. Feel that, bitch? Feel that? Yeah, that's what I thought. Oh, crap. That was a not very good dodge, but that's fine. That's right, you punk ass shit nugget. You nugget as shit. You sure about that? Are you talking about yourself? Oh, you're talking about yourself! I see! Well, you weren't wrong. Wow. There's still some dude who's alive and just walking about. Okay, I think he's gonna get there and turn around. Nope. Not doing what I expected. That's fine. That works to my advantage. Alright, miss. Death! Fantastic. So I guess that's everyone then. Great. Awesome. Can I bust this open or... I'm assuming I have to climb in through a window somewhere. Alright, well fair enough, I can do that. Don't look while I steal this shit. Nobody look. Assassin's armor. I like the sound of that. Does anyone know how I can get in here? Is there like a missing window panel or something, or some method through which I can climb in? Huh. Or am I not allowed to go in there anyways? I, oh, you know what? That might not be somewhere I can actually enter. 
I don't know why I assumed I could just go in there. I think it's because in, uh, Sa in uh, Odyssey, there were places that looked similar to uh, this area, these kinds of areas where I could go in. Maybe that's why. That's mine, and a specific general. With so much to see in Delphi, it may be hard to find me. I'm sitting at the plinth of the only bronze statue holding a spear and a sword. This great general is among seven of his peers. Hmm. Okay. So we need to look for a bronze statue of some general holding a spear. Got it. So that is that place completely done. We could look around for minor loot here and there, but what's the point, right? What's the point? As long as I don't know it exists. Out of sight, out of mind. That's how I operate. I don't see it, it doesn't exist. Alright. Um, let's use our nighttime well. Hmm. Spartan soldiers. I do need to deplete their forces again. It is weird that they just, their floor, uh, forces returned at full strength so suddenly and so quickly. But, maybe it's just I shouldn't leave the area before I face a wolf's den. Alright, fair enough. Um, how many wolves do I need to murder? Uh -huh. I think the alpha is sitting right there. All right, big boy. Why don't you get closer and get the jump on you? What? Oh, there! Oh man, you went too quickly. Shit! Oh fuck! Oh fuck! Come on, you son of a bitch! What the hell, man? You went too quickly into your cave. You could have just died a very merciful and peaceful death, but now I have to like tussle with you, completely annihilate your butthole. All right, get out of here, dog. Get out of here, evolutionary ancestor dog. Don't whine. That makes me <laughs> makes it a lot harder for me to kill you. There we go. Twenty three soft leather. Oh shit! There's another one. I didn't see it in the dark. Oh no. All right, it's dead. We're good. We're good. All right, maybe I should have my torch out. But I think that makes me easier to spot, doesn't it? Could be wrong. Oh. This was, of course, their retirement funds that I've... Mysterious object. The fuck? Did I just pick up a quest thing, or... Was it for another quest of mine? Well, anyways, the ground... ground see, I did it again. The ground mount, the grand mount... Parnassos is done. So let's make our way down there. Hmm. I wonder if it's something big. If it's something big. Whoa! Holy shit! It's the statue of Prometheus. And a bear and a boar are meeting for some illicit liaison. I wonder who will win. Bear versus boar, the ultimate challenge. <gasps> oh, is this the? Wise for man to revere Titios. He angered Zeus and the other gods, after all. Titios? Hmm. Wait, is this not the statue of Prometheus? Is that? Maybe it's not, because Prometheus is said to have been chained to a uh, rock and um, every day a an eagle, I think, would come by to um, rip out his intestines. Okay, a bear is now attacking the uh, cult area. <laughs> you go for it, buddy. Go kill him. Kill them all. I know the bears are incredibly easy to fight, but still. Where are you going? No, kill the cultists, man. Unless you're working in cahoots with them. What are you doing? That is the most confused bear ever. Oh, it's after the civilian. What the fuck, dude? 
There's a bunch of dudes who are like armed and shit that you should be going after, not the civilian. What an asshole. What a complete and utter asshole. Alright, well. Let's actually end the episode off here for now. We'll come back tomorrow and then uh, clear out the tomb of Titios. This is probably not the place where Elpinor is hiding, because that's what I initially thought. Um, but Elpinor is hiding by a, a statue of a snake or something? Maybe that's what they mean by snake. You know what? I'll show you guys the, uh... Fuck, alright, it's over. Damn it! Uh, turns out the NPCs are just as capable of taking out bears as I am. Oh well. Alright, so for now, thanks for watching and have a good breakfast!